All right, good morning. This is Jackie, my Apex train. It is January the 26th, I believe. I'm looking up there, I'm cheating. I have a digital clock up there. Yeah, I can't believe it. We're almost towards the end of the new month, of the start of a new year. And so I just wanna take a few minutes and say thank you so much to all our supporters and all our haters too, who didn't believe the Apex train would be going on to its fourth year. It's been a bit tumultuous with the pandemic going to the third year and with my multiple orthopedic surgeries, but hey, I'm back full time, full duty, working at an amazing hospital, local hospital as a bedside physical therapist. We're all still doing Apex training. Uh, most of it's online uh, through our app, um, just given the circumstances of just, you know, still social distancing, being a uh, be responsible. I mean, there's a still a lot of ongoing debate to mask, to not mask, to vaccinate, to not vaccinate. We're all like, and we're all one people. I know we have our different opinions of things and different viewpoints, but as best we can is to get along. And, you know, it's, it's so difficult. I get that. I get we're getting kind of worn out from, from all this with the inflation and uh, the economy going crazy, supply chain, the cost, cost, cost of everything, you know, from a candy bar to a car. I mean, it's crazy. But if we can extend a little bit of grace, a little bit of kindness, and know that on the other side of all this will be brighter days and just, um, you know, just better experiences to be had all the way around. But we, for now, we have to just get, work through it for together. Um, I know one thing I talked about with my orthopedist, I actually, yeah, I got a, an injection for my trigger finger, a lot of mileage on my body, 30 years of weightlifting, glorious weightlifting, and not one day of regret. You know, I still yearn to be able to Olympic weightlift, but you know, cost benefit and all that business. So what I want to talk about is like, you know, when they passed that marijuana bill for, for um, California and I think other states to be able to you uh, enjoy recreational marijuana or have a little, I don't know, bud or two, so, you know, I kind of think about this It's like, you know, we're, we're intended as a species and how we evolve and grow is to withstand some adversity, you know, as uh, Steve Harvey would say, you know, we need that stress. We need that pressure. It's what shapes us. It's what we, you know, take like recycled iron and, and such, and we turn it into an engine block. So without that stress, without that pressure, how are we supposed to rebuild and withstand and maintain and grow? and be able to to endure i mean you know most of you know that i'm a christian and some things we talked about is like keeping the faith and extending grace it's so true we we experience so many reproaches and trespasses and just ungratefulness from people across the board that really don't have a tremendous amount of self-control or choose not to exercise it doesn't mean that we have to lower ourselves down to their level not to say that we're better than them but in order to be <clears throat> extraordinary we have to just be extraordinary and not comply and abide by what the masses are doing so I challenge you uh, you know throughout the day is when you feel like that little trigger that just been struck it's just realize you know what I'm gonna step back a little bit I'm gonna give this person a little bit of grace you know I don't agree with what they have to say but I'm gonna hear them out and acknowledge what I've heard but does not mean that you know I'm a follower of them you know you're still your own person you know who you serve you know where you belong and that's the most important thing but you know in order to i say this in order to honor you know our god or lord is that we we do it through serving other we work we get, we we show him through through the people that are in between and me and him personally is that we have to go through people to show him that you know hey we're in it to win it long haul long run um, you know, I'm sorry if this message is kind of jumping all over the place, but I'm heading to my next medical appointment to my chiropractor. I uh, take care of yourselves. And I'm very grateful for my employer that had the faith and trust in me that I was going to come back stronger than before. So anyways, this is Jackie, my apex training BBC, be kind, be patient. And I'll see you guys next time.